Hi guys, it's Jessie here. I'm back with another video. Today's video is going to be a 10 minute room rescue. It's been a little while since I did this. Um, the room that needs rescuing today is my son's bedroom. 99% of the time it is my children's responsibility to keep their room clean. I have a rule every morning when they wake up before they go to school, they tidy up their rooms. Everything stays clean that way. They go in once a week, usually on Saturday or Sunday, and dust and vacuum just to keep up with that portion of it. They also wash their sheets at that point. Um, and this routine has been working out really great for us. Their rooms, both of my boys, they're 15 and 10 by the way, um, have remained clean for months now. And they are not the tidiest of people, so that is a humongous thing. However, since starting back to school, my oldest son especially has been struggling with time management and just making time for cleaning his room. He has been super busy. He's on the varsity soccer team. He's trying really, really hard this year to maintain his grades, which is a struggle for him. Um, he's got a lot of other things going on. He's just busy, okay? So some mornings he doesn't get around to cleaning his room. And I've been pretty lenient with it, not that big of a deal. As long as by the end of the week everything is kind of cleaned up and organized, I'm happy. This morning I walked into his room, and it's a little worse for wear. And since he's been doing so well this year, since he's been so busy, and I have time today, I'm going to tidy it up for him. If I do this once or twice a month, I think it's um, acceptable. He's a great kid. I'm a stay-at-home mom. I got nothing better to do, at least today. So. I'm going to show you guys the room. Honestly, it's really not that bad considering there have been times in the past where I walked into his room and could not even see the floor. This is really not that bad. This is just a couple of days of neglect. There's some clean laundry that needs to be put away. His bed needs to be made. Quick vacuum. It's probably going to take 10 minutes, maybe 15, um, but I thought I would film it for you today. So let me give you a quick little tour around, and then I'll put the camera on the tripod. We'll get it cleaned up, and uh, I'll be on my way. So here we go. So here is a look at Robbie's bedroom. It's a little messy, but it's still not terrible. Um, he has his bed that obviously needs to be made. He's got some clothes on the floor, um, his desk could use some clearing. He's got a stack of clean laundry here that needs to be put away. A few other odds and ends on the floor. His closet could be tidied up a little bit, but it's not too bad. Um, and then I'm going to vacuum and that's going to be it. So really shouldn't take long at all. And he's going to be so grateful for the fact that he doesn't have to do it with everything else he has going on. So I'm going to get the camera set up on my tripod here and we're going to get going.
it's not perfect. Um, my vacuum cleaner is not working right. I need to, I think, clean the filter or something. So the floor got vacuumed, but it didn't really pick a whole lot up. I need to do that, but um, it took a little bit longer than fifth. Uh, bleh. It took a little bit longer than ten minutes. I would say closer to fifteen because he had a bunch of laundry up here that was not put away properly. So I just took it all down and kind of organized it a little bit better, refolded some things, made his closet look a little bit better. I organized his desk and dusted it off. I have to take my cleaning products out of here. I used the Mrs. Myers glass cleaner on the mirror, which needs to be hung back up on the door. It fell down. That's my little trash bag I need to take out. Um, and then I, for all the surfaces, I used the Mrs. Myers apple cider scent, which is my favorite. I love this right now. It's limited edition for fall, so if you guys want to check this out, go on Grove Collaborative and get it while it's available. I will leave my link below if you guys are interested in that. Um, but yeah, I made his bed. He's got some poster board here that he's going to be using for a project and I didn't want it to get all bent up so I just placed it on his bed for him to deal with when he gets home. Um, I need to further vacuum the chinchilla cage area but until I can get that fixed, nothing I can do about that. And then I didn't really want to go into all of his stuff and start snooping around and messing with things so I left all of this for him to go through. I just cleared off the top. Dusted, turned on his fish tank light for his little beta fish there. Um, and then picked up all the dirty clothes, got those put in the basket, made the bed. And that's it. So that is my video for today. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Give this video a thumbs up if you did. Um, let me know what room you'd like to see me clean next for a cleaning video. Thanks so much for watching, guys, and I'll see you next time. Bye!